that's okay. It's K. I'm gonna turn. Let's see. Oh, I got one of those in there. Where is my andesite? Come on. 29. I'm up to 29. Woohoo. And I only need like 675 more. Okay. So what's my coordinates? My coordinates. Oh, let's go catch my thing. So we're starting at 15 and we're going down and we want to go 250. So that's minus 235. Okay. I know math. So that's approximately oh, minus 235. Don't worry, I'll get that diamond on my way back. Hmm. Oh, have I not done that yet in this world? Let's see. Oh, I do have my durabilities up. Okay. I wasn't sure if I did the, uh, what is it, F3 and H. I think that shows you how much durability you have left on everything. Whee! So I, I hope you are liking this series. Even though today... Um, this is going to begin the building part of the series, hopefully. I'm hoping you enjoy the resource gathering and how it's done. In my eyes, how it's done. One, two, three, four, five. Let's see, where are we? 198, and we said 235, so 233, maybe. We'll get there. So let's continue on our journey to the depths of where we should be. Now I'm going to run and keep running into this cave that I cleaned out. Two, three, four, five. Um, Fast and Furious 7 is coming out or is out I think it's out already and uh, my fiance has fallen in love um, with the series she oh I think I might have gone one too far I think this is where I want to end. Yep, this is where I'm going to end. So let me place a couple of blocks. Yeah, we'll go like this. We'll even leave a torch over here so nothing spawns. There we go. So we need to build our side tunnels. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So when we do the next tunnel down, one, two, one, two. Um, it will, we don't have to count out 250 blocks. We'll just run into this tunnel. Yeah. That's a ticket. So I should I, oh, what am I doing? One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. So I'm going to now start heading back. I have a pretty much completely empty inventory. And I'm going to start doing the, the side digs every fourth one down. So one, two, three, four. I'm thinking whether or not I should do tor mm, tutorials on this. You know, it's kind of basic Minecraft. But there's hopefully new people playing the game. Um, that would benefit from this information. So I know um, a few of the people who watch this series are pretty advanced and a lot of things I talk about <laughs> are not advanced. So it can be a little monotonous. One, two, three. 
But there's always, even in something that you've done a thousand times, there's always tips or tricks that people do that you go, oh, I should do that from now on. <clears throat> Excuse that noise. Two, three, four. A um, little while ago, I took my guitar apart to uh, replace a part, and um, I haven't gotten around to getting the part. So I have a couple of pieces of my guitar on my desk next to my computer. Um, so actually, no, that wasn't even part of my guitar. Those were Allen wrenches, which is something that used to take apart the guitar. It's not a great guitar, but it's a guitar that I... I want to get you. Okay. Um, it's a guitar I'm used to, and the one I play best on. Well, I almost did it again. No more dying in lava. Okay. Especially with the gear I have on, guy. At least my water bucket was on my bar this time. Jerk. Quiet lava. I don't mind when it makes lots of noise, but when it's quiet like that, it's like, eh, really? Uh-huh. <laughs> Okay, one, two, three, four. So I don't know. What do you guys think? Do you think this is a stupid way of doing it? Or is there a better way of mining? I actually enjoy doing it like this. Um, and I'm talking about being able to find stuff. quickly because mining I mean it's uh, one of the two main things in this game you mine things and you craft things so learning how to mine properly or you know learn how to get the f most for your time mining wise is kind of important for a game like this and I think this kind of does it but it's just my way and obviously I think my way is better than everybody else's way yeah, I saw that one. Two, three, four, five. Um, I don't know. So my baseball team, the Red Sox, been tearing it up the first beginning of the season. Now they're sucking it up. They have uh, starting pitcher issues. Everybody knew that before the season. And the first time through the lineup, they kicked some serious butt. But since then, it, eh. I think they're four and four in their last eight games. See, I don't know if I know this place. Let's check out this place. Whoa, okay. We need to make some more torches. There we go. And then I think we're gonna ugh, fill her up. Maybe not fill her up. Let's get rid of that. So let's go. Dun, dun, dun. Don't. No. Don't. Don't. I, um, was on one of my, the people who belong to, 
uh, the server I belong to, one of the guys, uh, Blues McGroove, who um, I've watched stream before, um, and I've played, I played the UHC with him. He was streaming last night, and I was in the stream, and I'm like, you know how you get into a stream, especially with people you know. You're like, oh, hi, hi, Blues, hey, how's it going, and saying hi to all the other people that play on the server. And then out of nowhere, um, because everybody knows me as Keith instead of K-Mace, who actually know me because I introduced myself to everybody as Keith. But, uh, now I was saying hi to everybody. I didn't, this is a big ass cave. I, uh, didn't realize who was there, but, and there was only like 25, 30 people in the stream. <laughs> and somebody comes up, oh, hey, Keith, how you doing tonight? And I'm like, Avidia? You don't know me, Avidia. But a video is in the uh, Minecracker was in there. I guess he's friends with Blues McGroove. Because I've seen uh, Blues play with him before. And it was uh, kind of nice to talk with a Minecracker for a little while. And he's one that I've uh, kind of helped convince me to upload videos because he's laid back like I am he's not one to like scream and yell oh my god this is a creeper oh my god I dropped my sword let's curse at it for 10 minutes no he's kind of laid back kind of Buddhist mentality just accept everything and let shit happens I don't know I said well if he's doesn't have to scream and shout to get views. Um, I don't have to scream and shout because I don't want to be screaming and shouting just for screaming and shouting just because that's what's popular. I don't need to put up PewDiePie it up so I get PewDiePie type counts. I mean, it would be nice. I guess I... If I was screaming it up and I was getting those types of views, I'd probably continue it, but I don't really want to, so I'm not. And that's one thing that a video is in and watching his channel has allowed me to believe is okay. And, and he is one of the few people I still watch his Minecraft episodes. So it's it was kind of nice talking to him. I'm getting eaten up right now too. I made too many monsters when I was talking about a video. So I didn't really uh, cause I also know. I didn't like that, mister. Uh, I want a light there. So even though I know he's a minecracker and I don't say I idolize him or anything, um, I didn't want to like bother him too much. I'm gonna have to get more. Dang it. Let's go like this. I hate having to do this. So I just talked to him like he was anybody else. Oh, hey, Nvidia, how's things going tonight? Well, eventually. Somebody came in and started, I shouldn't say give him a 
a hard time. But somebody started going, oh, so what are you going to do with this series? What are you going to do with Minecraft? What do you think of this and that? And it's just like, okay. And he finally said, okay, guys, I'll see you later. And I was like, oh, come on, dude. Why did you have to annoy the guy? I'd rather just hang out with the video again. I've done it before. Um, during my friend's stream. Um, and it's just like, you know, he's just looking for hanging out with friends type of thing. He doesn't want to be annoyed by people going, eh, eh, what's, what's going on with my car, eh? So my, my thing is, if you ever see somebody famous, it's nice to go over and say hi, maybe get an autograph. But if they're doing something private with their family or whatever, don't be harping on them and going, oh my god, it's it's Tom Cruise. Look at him eat. Look at him. Let's go over and destroy his dinner. It's rude. So I guess... I guess if I ever become a famous musician or something, come say hi, but if I'm doing something like peeing in a urinal or eating dinner with... Ooh, I don't have the right block there. Let's do this without dying. <clears throat> Just leave me be. And it's too bad because I. Come on. I'm gonna have to get that from the other side. Just leave those people be. Be. Unless it's somebody who, who says, you know, if you ever see me out there, you can come up and say hi. I have no problem. But I imagine, even with a video, he's probably tickled pink that somebody in real life would recognize him on the street or something. But when you're trying to hang out with friends online and they're giving them a you know, taken away from the stream of the person he's watching to ask him questions. It's kind of not cool. What is this? Is this some sort of... Hmm. So it was kind of fun hanging out with the video. Even though, other than the initial hi, I never really asked him any questions. I was just... It was, uh, I think he's doing a Grand Theft Auto series, like everybody else is right now. And that's what uh, Blues was playing in his stream. And one thing that I kind of liked about a video also is... This skin's the dude from The Big Lebowski, and that's one of my favorite movies. This is being more difficult than I thought. I thought it was done with sprawling cave systems. But obviously I'm not. Is there going to be... Oh, okay. I thought when I hit this there was going to be some lava coming at me. 